Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Hello everybody, welcome to the technical analysis for the Forex market from the ForexPsami.com. Uh, we will continue to talk about the currency of Euro Union today. Well, uh, as you can see, it's obvious that Euro currently has the upside, strong upside momentum. Well, uh, and yesterday we have suggested that possibly market could show some deep retracement and at least touch the pivot point, but that hasn't happened. Market just accomplished intraday ABCD pattern and continue move to the upside. This is rather uh, strong. Um, strong uh, signal for the mm, that points that possibly market will continue uh, move higher and could reach the higher uh, levels. Well, also, as we discussed yesterday, this pattern ABC suggests that it should happen because CD leg is much faster than AB leg and usually it suggests that market could reach 127 target, 147.73 right here or even 1618. Although both of these targets stand beyond the daily overbought area, this blue line shows level of overbought. Okay, but 127 is very close to current level. Also, take a look at this red dash line. This is uh, weekly pivot resistance 1, 147.45 and daily overbought. Also, 1618 expansion also stands right here. This is the expansion from this retracement, from this high to this low, 1618. So this will be rather strong area of resistance and I think that uh, the nearest time uh, we should focus on this area to fix the profits. So this will be our uh, near t nearest term target during the today, maybe tomorrow trading sessions. Well, so as we estimated the target, let's shift to the lower time frames to mm, look at the possibilities how we could trade it. This is the 4 hour chart. Here you can see clear the and got the triple 2 pattern, this initial thrust and ABC retracement. Well, this retracement uh, was sufficient just to correct market a bit lower. It even hasn't reached the weekly pivot point right here, although I suggest that it should do it. Well, this is also the sign of strength on the market. The target from this pattern, as you can see, A, B, C, bottom, 618 expansion target stands precisely at the same area, 147.51. So our area to watch for is 147.30. 147.70. This will be our initial target. Also, you can see that daily trend is bullish and 4-hour trend is bullish. So, for those of you who trade on the on these time frames, um, who use the daily contacts for the entering on in, on the market, um, you should search for the possibility to enter on the long side of the market. Now, let's shift to the um, hourly chart. Here we can see our previously discussed godless butterfly. Okay. Although uh, this, by the way. Precisely the target of for our ABCD, okay, it's right here. You can see it, and one with the seven expansion target of this butterfly. Although I think I thought that it could uh, move a bit lower, this will be this was enough, and this one with the seven butterfly has worked out perfectly. Also, take a look at the current level. You can see that this is 1618 expansion from the whole butterfly move. So here you can see the perfect example of how butterfly works when it works uh, correctly. Okay, so you can see that market precisely reached 1618 extension of the butterfly buy pattern. So this butterfly target, uh, current target has been achieved. The market shift to some retracement. Now what we see here, we can see some thrust to the upside on the hourly chart. Although this thrust is not perfect. Uh, mostly due to this area of such kind of choppy move. This is not very uh, welcome in the thrust moves because we, we see just two candles to the upside, some move, and again some candles to the upside. This is not very impressive thrust, but still this is the thrust and we do not see any significant retracement to, to the downside yet. This could be, in fact, the double repo lookalike pattern that could lead to some retracement lower. So we can see that market closed already below the 3x3. Three three. This is green line is the three simple moving average, three period simple moving average, fitted forward for three periods. Okay. Now it closed above it. 
If market will close below it again, then possibly we could see the double repose sell pattern that could lead to some retracement lower. And those of you who trade on the daily time frame mm, bias, you could use this possible retracement to the downside to uh, open long positions with the target around 147.50 area. For those of you who trade intraday in trade intraday patterns, you could use this pattern to trade on the short side of the market. And let's take a look at the possible target of this of this double repo pattern. So you can see that hourly trend could turn bearish very very soon. Okay, look at this. We have previous highs around 146.30 area. Also, if we suggest that C point already in place, we see we have A. B, C, top, 100% expansion stands precisely at this area and very close to the hourly conference support 146.17, 146.24. This is the target, possible target of this uh, double repo sell pattern. So if you are trade intraday, you can trade short with the target around 146.20. Okay. If you are trade on the daily time frame, you just should sit on your hands and wait when this retracement will ex ex exhaust okay and look the any buy signals in this area so this will be a rather strong support and market i suggest that should not move lower if it still has the bullish bias and still intends to continue move to the upside right to 4750 so that's been said mm, it's a couple of possibilities to trade uh, First of all, look at this area 146.17, for the possible buy signals in this area. Okay, with the target 147.51. Well, I suggest that possibly stops could be placed somewhere below this area, below 145.70. Okay, but the stop is very, um, very personal, and it will depend from your assets to your uh, risk taking possibility. So the choice is up to you, but I think that this area is, um, could be used for the possible stop placing. Okay, and look for the buy signals in this area. Uh, one thing that you do not want to see is just market when fall like a stone through this area. In this uh, situation, do not enter long. Wait for the clear signals from the market. Okay, if you enter the trader, well, possibly you could tra try to trade this. Uh, double repo if it will be confirmed if market will show close below the 3 by 3 below this green line on the hourly chart market should close below it only after that we can treat this pattern as confirmed the possible target also the same the area around 146.20 okay so we'd love to take your risk reasonable and be aware of the uh, growing in volatility due to FOMC meeting today be careful